Hello guys, uh, welcome to another uh, tool review video and in this one we will review a tool called Lazy Docker. It's a CLI based UI for Docker uh, and, and in this tool, using this tool you can see all your running Docker containers, uh, existing Docker images and if you use Docker Compose you can see also Docker Compose as a service with all it is uh, containers. So we will check it demo in a second, but uh, let's first check this uh, repository. And in, in this repository, you can find a uh, way how you can install, uh, what's the uh, features of this tool in more details. Uh, and it is also available for uh, Windows and, uh, and Mac and uh, of course Linux. Uh, and, uh, and more like how you can put uh, LAIs or, or like how you can use this tool. So now we can, uh, I want to show you like short demo on how, what it looks like for a real project. As an example, we use CodeGain project. You can find links in description. And in this project I have, uh, uh, like currently I have one uh, Docker container, which is MySQL running. And another one I can run uh, application to hit this MySQL database. And uh, on, on the tool itself, we will see the result. But before like seeing this in action, let's quickly review how it looks. So basically, uh, to navigate in the tool, you can use a mouse. So it is a CLI, but it supports mouse interaction. Uh, if you prefer keyboard, you can also do like a jump uh, between panels using this keyboard. Uh, so to, so uh, in terms of UI, it has two parts, left part for all your containers, images and volumes. In terms of Docker Compose, you will have one more pay, uh, pay, a panel uh, for uh, uh, Docker Compose services, as you can see on this uh, preview. Uh, and uh, like to see, you can click or enter uh, and uh, see, for example, logs. Uh, in this case, you can see stats. Uh, configuration and top within this container uh, and also in if it's like uh, if you want to go back to the left side you press ESC uh, escape key and uh, for example you can see also information about the image so this is like uh, details of this image uh, and so in terms of log I want to show how it works so uh, uh, this tool also uh, like uh, can recognize your local folder uh, and if you have a docker compose running in this uh, local folder or you have like some specific uh, docker file it will recognize it uh, like in this case it's prof x uh, container and we can see logs for, uh, and it's alive so i mean if we try to reach this uh, so I have a small Go application. If we try to reach this database, we should see all the logs uh, coming from, from this database. So in my case, it was like very, um, uh, a pin command. So we could see that it's uh, added uh, two more logs. You can basically keep this open always in your terminal and see logs live uh, coming live. Uh, and uh, and in my opinion, uh, I personally use it like uh, more than uh, actual docker commands of course you will need some time to jump to the uh, docker uh, commands itself or docker compose and see like since it's like more it has like more more features of course but just for navigating or checking logs and seeing what's happening uh, this docker, lazy docker is really a very useful command please check it out and thank you for watching this video and see you in another one bye bye